Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, My Project Ideas. In this tutorial, we will see how to change our GitHub credentials in VS Code. So my current login credentials are from this particular login, engineer to you for you. This is my GitHub. So basically there are two main steps for changing your GitHub credentials on VS Code. The first, you will have to sign out from your existing account. So you can go to this particular user icon on the left side, click on your email account, click on sign out, and you have successfully signed out. Now let's switch our GitHub accounts. For that, you will have to also sign out from the web browser where you're currently logged in. So let's sign out and log in, use login. And log in to our second GitHub account. So now I'm currently logged in. Now let's log in from our VS code. For that, again, click on the user icon on the left side. Click on backup and sync settings. Click on sign in, sign in with GitHub account. It will automatically open a pop-up on your browser where you have already logged in to your new account. Click on open with Studio code. Let's cancel this. So you have successfully logged in to your second account. So this was the first step. Now the second step is to change your GitHub username and email ID because username and email ID is something that VS Code stores it within its own settings. You can check it through the terminal. Let's type the command git config global user dot it will show you the existing username so this is the existing username that is being saved that is already saved and also the email id we need to change these two things so that whenever you do a push from this particular login it should go with the proper email id and name currently if i even if i'm logged into this particular deep 13 account if i do a push toward any GitHub repository, it will go by the name, by this email ID and this name, which is incorrect. So let's change this. To change this, same command, git config hyphen hyphen global user dot name, and then give a space and write in the actual name. So let's write in the actual name is deep13. And again, git config hyphen hyphen global user dot email. Let's give the actual email. So given the actual email. Once done, you can again confirm or recheck using the same command user dot name whether your credentials were saved successfully. Okay, so now that my credentials are saved, now if I do a push, it will go from the correct account and from correct username and email ID. So these are the two main major steps. I'll repeat the steps. The first step is to change your logged in account from this user icon, sign out and sign in with a new account. Second major basic and very important step is to change your username and email very important from terminal thank you for watching this video guys see you next time